Hi everyone, this is John from JD. Um, on the previous video, I already updated that the uh, market is going to bullish um, back in November and December onwards. So uh, today I'm going to talk about some growth houses and the uh, COVID-19 updates at this moment. So uh, this one is the uh, World Health Organization's website, WHO. There's an update on the vaccines. When will it be ready for distributions? You can see that the estimation will be uh, early mid of 2021. So uh, yeah, the expectation will be uh, mid of 2021. So um, the distribution will be by the Pfizer and BioNTech. You can see the details right over here on the Pfizer.com. And the, uh, there are news saying that the uh, UK government has wanted the emergency authorizations for the COVID-19 vaccine made by the Pfizer BioNTech. Okay, so uh, we are expecting the uh, vaccine to be ready by mid of next year. So when the expectation has come in into uh, stock markets, the market will retake early instead of waiting for the vaccine into the market uh, in the next uh, six to seven months later on. So let's have a look on the um, Glove update. So this one, uh, in love with the Glove. So I noticed that there are still a lot of people still in love with the Glove counters. They are still buying a lot of Glove counters because uh, they couldn't forget that they make money from the Glove counters um, back in uh, second or third quarters last year, so they are still can still memorize it a lot, the profit moments. So let's I'll go through some stocks in this listing. There's no recommendation for buying or selling for the stocks. It's just a case study for my own self. Okay, so let's have a look. Uh, what next? So uh, I believe you won't believe that who is the one who love the glove most. Um, definitely, it's not the Glove uh, CEO, not the top Glove CEO, not the Hapta Lagos. Guess who? The Thanos. The Thanos love the Glove the most in the world. So, let's move on next. So, this one is the top Glove chartings back in uh, May until now. So, uh, it's starting to move back in May, early on May, starting to move from 7 ringgit to over to highest 2030. And then uh, after you go through the X bonus, so it's moving sideways. So this one is before adjustment. So you can see the trend is very strong. You know why the trend is very strong? It's because the Thanos got the last diamond on his glove, which is COVID-19. So with the snaps on the glove fingers, so it can bring some price from 7 to 29 minutes. Okay. So let's have a look on the adjustment for the top group. This one is the adjustment for the bonus issue. So we can see that the um, adjustment the after the adjustment, um, the glove felt the top glove is moving sideways, and it, may, it managed to testing the previous size after adjustment previous size. So it forming a du double top right here, forming a double top which is nine fifty something. So all after that, it all the way come down and tested the support level, the support level which is formed two times at six ringgit. This one will be serving as a critical support level six ringgit for the top glove at this moment. So we can see that the uh, top glove is moving a. Uh, very big gap of the uh, sideway within the six ringgit to nine sixty five ring cent level. So this one is the very big gap. You continue trading within this range. Let's say it's break down to six ringgit, you go lower again. So uh, at this moment, you move continuously moving sideways. So um, it, I I don't think it will move a lot upside at this moment. Although the revenue profit will be contributing next few quarters still very good. So um, okay, let's move on for the next counter, which is Hatta Lega. Hatta Liga starting moving up from 720 plus over to highest is uh, 21st, 16. So after that, it's moving sideways. There is no strong trend there after. So it's more or less the same, which is uh, starting to move in back in May. And then the uh, highest level form in August, early August. Okay, next, Kosan. Kosan rubber. So Kosan rubber starting to move in May as well. 550 something all the way to 1950. Highest level. All this moving within uh, uh, about uh, three months times hit to the highest and then come down and then it comes in a bonus issue as well so this one is not adjusted chart so we have a look on the adjusted chart so this one is the adjusted chart so after the bonus issue is still moving sideways so there's no strong trending at this moment so because uh, the expectation for the vaccine is coming out for the uh, maybe six to seven months next supermax supermax is um is more crazy i mean um a lot of people speculate so it's starting to move below train to it which is a uh, one forty something. I would say um, starting to move all the way to twenty four and forty four and highest level, which is a uh, more more than tenfold. So after that bonus issue and then uh, it's moving sideways. So let's have a look on the adjustment of the supermax corporation bonus. 
So this one is the adjustment. It's still moving sideways at this moment, so the support level will be somewhere around seven ringgit. Okay. Okay, with the expectation of the vaccine coming out, so it definitely will pull back the blue counters. Okay. So uh, I would say during the bull in November and in December bullish markets, uh, the growth counter wouldn't move outward much. It will continue worsely moving sideways. So the the counter has been shifted from the growth to other industry, banking or whatever, because the Thanos has losing its growth powers. The Tony has captured it. So the other industry, small and mid caps, banking, finance, all those things which is very low at this moment, they will start to spiking up. So in fact, it's already spiking in November and uh, I believe December will continuously spiking one after another, especially for the small cap counters. So you can see the top volume page, there are a lot of counter will be spiking a couple ten percent. Maybe there will be a happen something like counters limit up soon. So um, that's all for today. Thank you very much. Goodbye.